Yeah, thank you very much also for the uh, invitation to this uh, conference. Um, of course, it's uh, a pity that uh, it is not uh, being face to face, and I would love to see Prague, of course. Um, but uh, however, it, we can do the presentation, we can do the keynote, and you can listen to me. That's uh, at least uh, some experience we can might have in these days. Um, as um, Janis mentioned, as I am from Graz, University of Technology. Uh, in Graz, we have, um, in summary, uh, six universities, and uh, we are the University of Technology. We have about uh, 16,000 students and seven faculties, and uh, of, um, about 3,000 lecturers. And uh, my responsibility there is uh, that I am the head of the Educational Technology Department. And uh, there we have uh, to do all the e learning activities for our students. So we have uh, to do mainly the, the main stuff is uh, hosting a learning management system, a streaming server, and we have also a MOOC platform. And uh, today I, will, I would like to talk um, about this uh, platform and about uh, the issues of learning analytics and also uh, about open educational resources and why we think that uh, those three things are really good to bring together and uh, see not a separated uh, field of research. Um, so the, the title of my talk will be MOOCs, Learning Analytics and uh, Open Education Resources, a perfect triangle for the future of education. Uh, in any case, you would like to contact me, um, you can do it on the web. So I have uh, all over accounts, uh, it doesn't matter if it's Twitter, Facebook or ResearchGate, whatever you would like to use. Just feel free uh, to, ask, to ask me any questions or to, to find our uh, solutions, even in those days. Um, in Austria, we have uh, the lockdown of the universities on 10th of March. So we are already eight weeks of uh, lockdown and we were switching completely to distance education. And uh, the switch was very heavily to our uh, department, of course, because we have to switch as uh, all lecturers and all students online um, to become a distance learning university is a really challenging part if you are not prepared to be a distance learning university. But uh, currently we are running and uh, it's running rather smoothly. We have the servers up and um, we're very heavily used all the um, e-learning activities. And uh, the very funny thing is that we next week uh, we will begin uh, for the first face-to-face -face, uh, assessment. So that means that we are going back uh, um, to the universities and uh, so it, we come to the next phase, I always say. But now to the talk. Um, the first thing is um, I'm talking about imooks.at. Um, maybe you can uh, go to your browser.